today I'm home and uh, this dish is called Genovese it's called Genovese because the story or the legend I don't know says that in the 16th century why in Naples there was a plague and this this big um, ship arrived from Genova and they got stopped they had nothing to eat they only had a big cargo of onions so the Neapolitan people gave them some second cut meat and uh, and some macaroni as always pasta and they made this dish so it basically piece of beef has to be the shank of the, of the beef this dish is very long you need six hours you don't have to be in rush okay I just put some olive oil in the fry pan and that's just roasting the meat that meat has to be sealed okay this is the same piece of meat you can use for making a broth onion celery and Silvia is cutting the carrots. Uh, Silvia today is uh, our friend. He came, he came to join us. Okay, yeah. And uh, go, go see. You got put also this inside. And uh, yeah, he was really nice because you know he cut me all the onions. So one kilo of meat, you need two kilos and a half of onions. I just stealing the meat on one side and the other side so it's gonna give some flavor to the oil oil this meat is gonna cook for six hours so there is no better dish for the quarantine because you can have the meat and then you can make the pasta so after you cook this is full meal once this is done you put it on the side like this And you add the carrots. And then the celery. It's so nice to have an assistant like Silvio, you know? And then it's very cheap. You only need a vodka tonic. And then it's happy with it. <laughs> Caramelize the, the vegetables. Nice and shiny as always. No salt, you don't add salt. At this point you add half of the half of the onions. Rest of the onions, and then you put the temperature really very low. What is going to happen now that uh, is that the onions is start melting, and there will be a lot of water, and it's going to make a nice juice, and everything is going to cook together. So you put it very very low. Actually, you know what? I want to put it here. The smallest gas I have. I don't need a strong one. Here we are. This is too strong. Then you just add eight, nine peppercorns. You leave it here like this. I like it a bit more. Okay. It needs to be covered because then humidity is, is going to cook everything. And you leave it like this, you don't touch it you know, for almost half an hour. The genovese is going to take almost four hours, so I hope we're not going to get, get drunk. This is the normal size of vodka tonic that we normally have in Positano. Cheers. With lemons from the garden. Salute. Salute. I forgot one ingredient six cherry tomato you see it's, uh, it's, it's cooking there's a lot of uh, humidity and all the humidity now is gonna already is giving some smell it's not gonna stick as long as the the, the fire it has to be really very low you have to be patient and not touch it very much okay it's good that's what we're gonna eat tonight okay, fine, fine. The base will be from tomorrow it's very very good. <laughs> That's the result after one hour and a half. We still have a long time to go. How many drinks have you had so far? Only two. One and the second is over there. No, no, no. 
two. It's, it's, it's no. Ah, one. It's, it's, off. It's, it's off. It's off. <laughs> it's off. Yeah. So now this is the result after three hours of cooking, where it's low, and we added some wine. Okay, add just one glass of wine, and that's it. So it gives more acidity to the onion. It makes the onion to be more digested. It still has to cook for the three hours. When everything becomes brown. Mila, you agree? Ti piace il genovese? Yes. Ce la mangiamo dopo. Ciao, ciao. After three hours, you move the meat from the sauce, because otherwise it's already cooked. And then you start breaking the carrots inside it. And now, at this stage, there's to cook for two hours. The assistant did it with you. Another assistant. How many animal assistants do we have in this cooking process now? Look at that. Look at that. I do this a lot much. I love all the people. It's like a corn beef. It's like a corn beef. Un pastrami. I'm just adding the genovese to the pack, to the to the pasta. Here we are. This is a hungry group of, of men been working in the fields all day. Genovese is going to go on the plate.